Smithy Bauer, Associate Field Agronomist for Farm Journal. Today I'm near Decatur, Michigan on Stamp Farms corn nematode trial. We're doing some analyzing and inspecting of the root systems. Uh, the root I have here in my right hand is a seed treatment with Botivo on it, which should help give us some control of corn nematodes. The one here on my left has just the traditional insecticide seed treatment on it. And when we look in uh, close at these roots, ideally what we're looking for in a root system is to have uh, our roots growing down at a 35 to 40 degree angle with lots of fine root hairs on them. And as you can see in this sample here, we have very good root system with good root hairs. Everything is growing down at that 35 to 40 degree angle. So overall, I'm very happy with what I'm seeing with this root system. If I go ahead and take a look here at the non-treated side that just has an insecticide treatment on it, we can start picking up a little bit of visual signs in these, in these corn roots here. For example, on this root here, we can see that these roots have gotten kind of club shaped uh, down here uh, toward the tips of these roots. So instead of having lots of really nice fine root hairs, we're picking up this club shaping, which is often a sign of corn nematode damage. We can also see another example here where we have some clubbing as well, and it's kind of pruned to some extent their overall rooting depth. Here's another example of some that has some kind of club-shaped roots on it as well. The other thing that we notice about these areas that have some of that uh, clubbing is that they're also very brown in color instead of a nice white bright color. So it's not a very healthy root system in there because of the nematode pressure. 